Hi, guys. Happy little day. Today. Now, I'll go to another episode of this junk where I make a song and I can't hear it the whole time. Today we're gonna do a very highly requested band. I'm gonna make a Death Grip song with my computer completely on mute. I cannot hear what I'm doing the entire time. And then at the end of the video, we're gonna listen to the song and see how close I got. How close I got to the original. This one's gonna be the hardest one yet. I can just smell it. There are two songs I was so torn between for this video. So I posted a poll on my Instagram and was like, which song do you think I should do on mute? Should I do Get Got? Or should I do you think he loves you for his money, but I know what he really loves you for. He loves you for your leopard skin print hat. And get got one by a, by a pinch. All right, guys, I'm going to listen to the song one time before I meet my, my computer. Get a refresher, take some notes on it, okay? Is that a crime? I get to listen to the song once before I turn all the sound off. Is that a crime? Sue me for that crime if that's a crime. <laughs> Oh God, slow down, slow down. This is a bad idea, guys. This is gonna be like horrible. I kind of gave up on the notes for this one. <sighs> All right, guys, the computer's on mute. Can't hear a damn thing. That's right, not a single thing. Let's start out with that noise. I feel like this could work. Something about that tells me that could work if we speed it up. It looks like it's fast enough, definitely does. And if I look up Death Grips and that's like the first thing that comes up, Get God's like their most favorite song, like it's everyone's fan favorite song. That's gonna be close enough, right? See, the nice thing about this Death Grip song is like, I don't even need to take that many notes on it. I don't even need to take, take, take that many notes on any Death Grip song I try to make without hearing it because I just know them that well. I just listen to them that much. I know them that well in my- High pitched, fast guitar solo. No! Fine. Settle for fast guitar solo if they don't have anything high pitched in a major key. Really? Nothing? Fine, guitar solo. We can just make it fast and we can make it high pitched. Jesus Christ. I'm thinking this one might be a good one because it's already close to G major. It's pretty dang close. It's a guitar solo cliff. Cliffs of Dover. Already a fast song. It's nothing but guitars. I'm thinking that's what they're talking about here. I'm thinking can't go wrong with this. This one probably sounds just like Death Grips. Oh, okay. See, this is kind of fun because there's no BPM, so I have no idea what tempo it's supposed to be in. It's really avant-garde. And there's one thing about Death Grips is that they're avant-garde. They don't play by the rules. They just do their own stuff. So I could just use this. So I'm thinking, what if we take this, we pitch it up by like 24, and then we quantize it by the eighth note, just to really make sure. That's probably good. Ooh, all of a sudden it's brighter in here. Oh, all of a sudden I put the lights on. It's like this whole time I forgot to put the lights on, all of a sudden the lights are on. Oop, wake up everyone, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. This thing I bet would happen probably here. At this point guys, I'm just gonna make stuff up. I'm just gonna guess. Oh, so this thing, I wonder if we should put a tremolo on it. A little tremolo on this thing. I think this thing could use one thing and that's a tremolo on that thing. A little eighth note tremolo, maybe a 16th note tremolo with no smoothing. I don't know if it's just me. Something about this kind of looks like it's missing something. I don't really know what it's missing, but it looks like it's actually, as a matter of fact, it looks like it's missing a lot of things. Gay, 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 blood rush to my head, popping off the blah, 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 blah. Top 5 Dragon Volume Blast and Ball on that. My also, guys, quick update on the situation. We're pretty overdue for an update. A lot has happened since I talked to you about this last. These two are still fighting. It's not looking good. They really, they can't even sit on the same shelf. It's like kind of annoying. These two are best friends. They're not married yet, but that's okay. I think it's fine. Makes sense. They're babies. They're not going to get married. These two are best friends. They don't ha want anything to do with these two anymore. I know they used to. They kind of used to be like acquaintances, but it's not really... They kind of just grew apart. Nothing out there can't stay inside. Hit the bar, sleep deprived. Who drove this car? I'm still alive. These two, brother and sister, obviously, you know, you mix 
siblings with business things aren't going to go well naturally there's going to be fights but it's been fine so far because they've been doing really well at their new job at Dairy Queen they've been loving it actually hanging out with these two after work sometimes they go to the bar and get a sip after work it's fun. Stop, 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 stop. So many ways, skin the frame. Remember when first got strange. Now I just think that life obey. So what comes next? Right away. Right away. Right away. Right away. Right away. A couple new additions to the family. These two really made themselves comfortable today. Really made themselves comfortable ever since they showed up yesterday. Making themselves really comfortable with these two. I'm a little too comfortable, actually. I'm like, you guys are too close. You're going to outnumber me and overthrow the house. I can't have you overthrow the house. And I especially cannot have you put these two on the same goddamn shelf again. It's not going to happen. It's not going to happen. I'm keeping a close eye on them because it can't happen. They're not going to go on the same shelf. They're not going to go on the same one with the same books on it. And this guy wants nothing to do with anyone. So that's the update on that. Um, let me know what you guys think. If you have any questions on that, I know I haven't talked about it in a while, so, uh, yeah, maybe next time I'll have more to say. All into my head, pierced the bone and felt the breeze, lived my thoughts out then with the far of skeleton wings, No, nothing since then, it seems, been floating, thought the next is starting dreams. Oh, God damn it. Get, 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 get. Man, making the song without the sound on was really taking me back to my glory days, guys. My glory days where... There's nothing else I could listen to except for this. This is really only the only thing that my brain really wanted to hear was Death Grips. And it kind of altered my brain chemistry, honestly. There was a huge part of my life where literally all I listened to was Death Grips. That's it. Honestly, I was doing some heinous things in my prime time of listening to Death Grips. Like, really heinous stuff. Stuff I didn't even know you really shouldn't do. Like... When I was in college, there was a period of time where my one of my favorite pastimes was playing this game called Laser Pointer. I'd have all my friends come to, <laughs> come to my dorm. My dorm, I went to school in Boston. And if you've never been to Boston, there's this park in downtown in like the heart of Boston called the Boston Common. It was where one of the public transportation stops was. So a lot of people would like get on and off there. And my dorm faced this really busy sort of area of the Boston Common. And on, like, Friday, Saturday nights, my friends would come over and sometimes, like, we'd stay up late at night and then, like, these hammered people would just walk around. <laughs> it's horrible. Like, it's really bad. Hammered. Like, drunk. Really drunk people would, like, walk around and, like, go in and out of the, the T is what the public transportation is called, like, the T stop. And there would be times where there'd be, like, three, four groups of couples and they'd be, like, making out in the Boston Common, like, on this corner of the street and I'd get my laser pointer and I'd point it out at the window and try to like get people to <laughs> look away and like notice the laser pointer and like see what they would do if like they saw the laser pointer on the ground but I didn't realize that's like a really bad thing to do like it's I think it's like illegal long after the laser pointer game became a thing that was of the past there was an email blast sent out to the entire dorm building at one point. I'm pretty sure that was like, hey, whoever's sh shining their laser pointer out of the window, that's like a serious issue. And like, you will get in serious trouble if we find out it's you. It was a really bad thing to do. I, I don't think you should do that. You don't, you shouldn't shine a laser pointer at people. It's morally not right. Been floating, thought the next is starting dreams. Get, 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 got, 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 blood rush in my head, the hot lock popping off the, mm, blah, not calling rhythm, blah, not, blah, not, get, 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 got, 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 blood rush in my head, nah. It's not like I would try to shine it in anyone's eyes. I'm not a monster. I wouldn't try to shine it in anyone's eyes. I wouldn't shine it on people. I'd shine it next to people, like on the ground. See if they'd notice. Ooh, laser pointer. Ooh, laser pointer. It's like, you know, you shine a laser pointer at a cat and then it chases a laser pointer. Like, what happens if I shine it at four groups of drunk couples in the Boston Common making out. Which one's gonna chase the laser first? It's not right, like it's bad. I don't know, what What do you guys do? You guys got any stories, college stories? What do you do? What's your deal? Oh, she's such a bad person. Oh, she does things that she regrets. What do you do? It was pretty bad though. Like that is a horrible thing to do. Like I've really freaked some people out. All right, guys, I've already kind of accepted defeat with this one. I already know it's gonna sound nothing like it. 
You guys already, you clicked into this video, really, you clicked into this video thinking I was going to make it sound exactly like Get Get Got by Death Grips. Yeah, that's funny. Maybe if the Instagram poll would have voted on you, think he likes you for your money. I know what he really likes you for. He likes you for your leopard print skin hat. Maybe I would have made a song a bit closer to the original, but Get Got, there's just no way. It's too fast. Let's listen. Gay, 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 blood rush in my head, da, da, popping off the blood, da, 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 wasn't there, wasn't there, wasn't there, wasn't there. See, this, this isn't even the right noise. This is just a drum beat. Everything is so loud. I mean, honestly, I kind of nailed, like, the vibe. Gay, 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 blood rush in my head, and how that popping off the block and running, 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 Anyway, skin the frame. Remember when first got strange? Now I just think of life away. So what comes next? Right away. Right away. Right away. Right away. Right away. God damn, guys, this sucks so hard. This sucks like total stuff. Really sucks some stuff. You know, I looking back, if I would have done this one differently, I think I would have put more effort into really trying to figure out the structure of the song. But that's the thing with like trying to make this song on mute, I feel like what helps me a lot when I normally pick a song to make without being able to hear it the whole time is that I can clearly sort of understand the structure and be like, okay, well, this is where the pre-chorus is going to go. Like, this is the chorus, you know. Death Grips, it's like, okay, it's one huge verse and then chorus, post-chorus, one huge verse and then chorus, post-chorus. But it's like so hard to be able to tell how long. It's just... Maybe if you guys would have voted for it, you think he likes it for your money, but I know he really likes it for you, but he likes it for your leopard print skin hat. Maybe it would have sounded a lot better. Come on, New York City! Get up! So let me know what you think of this one, guys. I think for my next trick, I'm going to do a making a song from memory. I know I already said that was going to be my next trick, but then you guys said to make a Death Grip song on mute, and I thought that's a great idea. I'm going to do that before I make a song from memory. I think my next trick, I'm going to make Chop Suey by System of a Down from memory. That was also a big suggestion. I think that's such a good idea. But I think I'm going to do the Death Grips thing again, except I'm going to make a Death Grip song from memory. Yeah, I think that's going to be really good. It's going to sound really good. You guys are gonna like that. So thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, just give it a like, okay? Subscribe to this channel. I upload whatever the hell I want. Been doing a lot of funny business over here lately. It's pretty cool. And thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for your support. It really means a lot to me. And thank you guys so much for the support on the music I do make while I can hear it. I put out a few new songs recently. One of them on the Dev Lemons Project. Another one on Queef Jerky. Pretty cool. And you guys have been really nice about them. So I think that's really nice. Thank you guys. For being so nice and liking my stuff. A lot more new music coming out this year, guys. On the Dev Lemons and the Queef Jerky front. A lot of new stuff coming out this year. I'm really excited to put a lot of junk out that you guys are going to listen to. I hope. You guys are really nice. Yeah. And I hope you have a really nice night. And day. Yeah, I hope you do have a nice night. And a day. Okay. Uh, bye. <laughs>